Hello Aquarius, welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your weekly love message for October 21st through October 27th. Okay, I just want to let you guys know that I'm working with a new deck today and it's called the psychic hopefully there's not too much of a glare on there the psychic tarot card card psychic the psychic uh, tarot oracle deck by john holland and i really really love this deck okay so if you want to pick it up pick it up okay all right so love message general love message for Aquarius for seven little days. All right, Aquarius, what is going on in your love life? What is the, what's the energy around you for these seven little days? October, October 21st, October 21st through mm -hmm, October 27th. Okay, angels, what is going on? What is going on for Yes, 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 for Aquarius. What is going on for Aquarius? Do, 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 do. Angels and guides, what is going on for Aquarius? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Angels, what is going on for Aquarius these seven little days? Do, 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 do. Angels, what is going on? for Aquarius <laughs> for these seven little days in your love life. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What is going on? Do, 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 do. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, let's get right into this. Okay, ready for this? Whoa, love begins. How is that? How beautiful. With the four of clubs, you're like, yup. Mm -hmm. Love is beginning with the six of hearts and you're like, it's going to last. This love is going to last. Yes, it is. And it's going to be beautiful and you have made up your mind. It will. Okay. All right. Now, when we look into the recent past, I see that you have been patient patiently planning that is i don't know what have you been, what have you been planning patiently planning in the recent past and i feel like with the seven of spades this this patience this patience has really i feel like i feel like you're like you know what i'm i'm just gonna let the universe take care of it and how it plans out is how it plans out okay and boy that was a lot of work while you were waiting yes it was in your love life you were just like ah how long is this going to take? Ah, like, like I can see, I can see, right? right. Now, in the middle of the week, we have foundation and achievement with the four of hearts and the ace of hearts. So I feel like in the middle of the week, you're, you're like, mm, I feel like, I feel like you, you're getting, you're getting what you, like you, you did all the planning, you, 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 you were patient and I feel like things are now going your way, right? And you feel so secure and you feel so like, um, happy and safe in, and this is you, this is you, you feel happy and safe in your love life. How beautiful is, is that? It's, it's gorgeous. It's absolutely gorgeous. Okay. Now by the end of the week, your intuition starts to kick in, okay? With the jack of spades and the five of clubs. So it's like, you get a sign. Mm -hmm. You get a sign from, yeah, your higher self. And it's like the jack of spades is saying, you know, I'm not sure about something. Is this, is this really what I think it is? Or is it not what I think it is? And I feel like by the end of the week, you're going to have a change of mind. And I feel like, I feel like it's because of, I feel like it's because you get a, a you know, it's like a sixth sense about, about your relationship. Like something like, huh? Like maybe your partner, maybe you and your partner are having a conversation and you, and you, and everything is going wonderfully and beautiful and ah, love, 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 right? And then all of a sudden they say something and you go, I wonder why they said that, right? I wonder, and then you wonder, is this really as good as I think it is? I'm just not so sure. And then you kind of back and forth, back and forth in your mind, right? Now, now your bonus is material harvest. So something about this relationship, being in the relationship, um, 
brings, like maybe, you know, it's like um, the person that you're with, when you're with this person and you bring your money together, it's like this relationship brings abundance. It, it, it's like more in the pot now because, you know, it's not just my money, it's my money and my partner's money. And when we put it together, it's like, yeah, there's a lot of money. So that's a good thing, right? Like we share, we share, like maybe, maybe we split the bill, maybe we split the, the, um, the rent, maybe we split the mortgage or things of that nature, but it makes life easier. It definitely, the money in the relationship makes life easier, right? But then you feel emotional loss. There's something about this with the personal, with the um, partnership. All of a sudden, it's like, it becomes a little bit more like a partnership, right? It becomes more like a partnership. And the five of spades is saying there's going to be some type of change. And I feel like, I feel like there's like, it starts off like a beautiful week, a gorgeous week, very, very gorgeous. You feel secure, you feel safe. And then this Thing, this, this, you, you get this sign from your, your higher self and, and maybe you realize, maybe you start to realize that is this relationship about money? Is this a relationship? Am I drawn to this relationship because of the, the material things I get from the relationship, right? Or maybe they do. Maybe maybe it's not you. Maybe they do. Um, but whatever it is, your intuition, and maybe it's not that at all. Maybe your intuition is intuition is telling you something different. But no matter what, you're starting to. Um, I feel like. I feel like it's the joining, the joining. Maybe maybe your partner helps you out with your business. Maybe your partner helps you out um, getting you contracts or, or things like that. But it's definitely a benefit to this relationship. Now, the emotional withdrawal, I feel like, I feel like that comes from your intuition and your questioning. There's something about the relationship that you're questioning, almost like, I wanna say, is it too good to be true? Is it too good to be true? And I feel like you're going to kind of like um, start digging into that, digging into that. And this two of diamonds, I feel like you're looking at it more as a partnership versus a love relationship. And I feel like changes will definitely happen as a result of that. Now, you're probably thinking, what are the changes? And I don't want to leave you, you know, for seven days. And you're like, what are the changes? What are the changes? Okay, what are the changes? What? What what are the changes? What are the changes? Angels and guides, we, we just need one message. What are the changes? You know what? We're not to know right now. It's the joker. We can't know. The universe is saying, not right now. Sorry. <laughs> so it starts off as a very lovely, beautiful, loving week. Everything feels wonderful and everything feels just right. And by the end of the week, there's like this aha moment. And you start to question and question and question and, until you're overly questioning until the love it's like you, it's like the love just kind of drains right out and it becomes more of a i feel like it becomes more of a like these questions are becoming so intense it's like these conversations these these like you're questioning your partner about the sign, the message that you received, you're questioning and questioning. And as you're, the more you talk about it, the more you talk about it, the more it's like the emotional part leaves and the, um, and it's almost like you're finding out something that maybe, um, I feel like you didn't know. I feel like you didn't know. And, um, and you're unsure about it. I feel like you're uns you're definitely unsure about it. You're not. You're un there's something about the relationship that you you weren't even thinking about. It just came out of the blue, and then all of a sudden it just came to you. You discussed it with your partner, and now you're like, what? Huh? What? Right? So because you're uncertain, and there, I feel like they may be uncertain as well. I feel like it's kind of back and forth, back and forth, until at the end of the week you have the Joker. Things do change, but. I don't know where they change to. The universe isn't isn't saying it's it's 
There is a change that is coming. So I say enjoy the beginning of the week, enjoy the middle of the week. And when you have that moment, that aha moment, be very careful and be very tender in these conversations because we don't know what the end result will be, okay? I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.